If you are new revert or new to Islam, you need to understand that born Muslims are not your role models. They're not the people you should be looking up to and you shouldn't be trying to have them understand what you are going through. They can't. What I mean with that is the people who have been born into Islam and their families have been practicing Islam for generations, they can empathize with you, but they can't understand what you are going through. They don't know what it's like to be the only one and the first one. So when Ramadan comes around, you're going to be looking up to all these videos where they have full homes and their families are gathered around the table and they're celebrating, you know, Ramadan and they're having those beautiful family events. You're gonna be feeling left out you're gonna be feeling lonely and you will think well this doesn't feel right you're looking at it from the wrong angle they've been practicing Islam for generations but you are the first one me you are the first Muslim of your community of your family everyone who will follow you you will have your reward for it your future children your everybody around you who follows your example you are there role model you are the one who starts a whole new generation if you want to find a group of people who you can identify with who you can say wow i know what this is like this is exactly what i'm going through then it is the companions of our prophet they are the first generation they went through what you are going through believe me if you want to feel like someone understands, you can understand, you can relate to somebody, it is the Sahaba, not us, not the born Muslims. The Sahabas, they went through everything that you are going through and much more. They've been imprisoned. They have been left out. They've been kicked out of their own families. They've been divorced because of accepting Islam. They lost their wealth. They lost their community and their status in the society. Some of them were Jewish before, some of them were Christians, some of them were pagans. So you will be able to find personalities in the history who you can relate to and see, wow, this is like my life. I can feel the connection. I'm not the only one. I'm not left out. Please go and study the stories, the lives of the companions, all of them. Study their lives. You will feel so much better about where you are right now. And don't be sad. Don't be feeling like you are missing out. Because yes, some of the videos make us feel like, wow, they have big families, they have iftars, and I have to pray by myself. I have to eat iftar on my own. I have started like that too. I was my first one. I was alone. I didn't have a big family to have iftar with. I was the only one and I wasn't accepted or respected by my family. I had to hide sometimes that I'm fasting or praying. But look, now I have my own children who are following my steps and alhamdulillah now they have their children. Inshallah they are following their steps. But I think I will be able to take credit for that. I was the first in my family. I was the first in my place to start and I hope inshallah I can take credit for the future generations who are following what I have started. So look at it from that perspective. You are the first.